We're back for another rendition of Floor Groceries. Hello, everyone. My name is Lisa, and I'm the Viet Vegan, because I'm Viet and I'm vegan. Let's take you on the groceries that I did today. $60 worth of groceries. This should last us just over a week. Let's go. So one of the things I bought is black sesame powder. I've been making mooncakes or experimenting with mooncakes, so I want to use this. I also kind of want to make some drinks, some like bubble tea with this, some grass jelly business. So I'm excited about that. Um, I bought some udon noodles. I love udon noodles. I don't know. I used to not like them that much, but now I really love them. So I bought some room temp ones, like like fresh ones, and then I bought some frozen ones because these were actually cheaper. These are like uh, $2.99 and these were $3.99, and this only has four, and this has like a lot more. I eat udon noodles a lot, so I should probably just stock up because I've been eating a lot of hot pot gray konyaku um, eat the konyaku noodles these are shirataki noodles I actually prefer not the noodles and I prefer the blocks but I haven't been able to find them so I only have the black nudes for more nudes we have some yuba noodles so we have these like thicker ribbon ones and we have these thinner ones so I really like these for hot pot I find like the ridged sort of texture picks up like the oil and the flavor really well both very good this one says specifically for hot pot but i like eating both so those are gonna go in the fridge despite having like not a lot of food in here there's not a lot of room it's like mostly beverages the bottom is like all beverages carrots i don't know why i made this so close let's just bring you a little closer shall we i got some grass jelly i've been in a big grass jelly phase lately so you know, grass jelly is a good time. I just did a video about three different ways that I enjoy grass jelly. So if you wanna watch that, I'll leave it linked in the, the corner. I bought glutinous rice flour. So this is like the sticky rice flour or the sweet rice flour. I wanna make snowy mooncakes. I found a version of like a, like a mooncake that you don't need to bake on the outside, which I think is really interesting. So I wanna use that. Brown sugar, this is a vegan brand. Well, it's not completely vegan, but most of the refineries in Canada are vegan friendly. So we have brown sugar. You guys have seen me buy this tons of times. Very delicious. Great for hot pot. Stir fry. Snow peas, also for stir fry. Mushrooms for deliciousness, also for stir fry. Got some limes for mixed drinks. Tomatoes, I wanted to make feta pasta, like the TikTok one. I have a recipe on my blog if you want that. I'll link it down below. I made it on TikTok. And spinach. Uh, Eddie wanted vanilla Coke, so we have a vanilla Coke for him. And then we wanted fruit, but most of the fruit at the market didn't look super hot. So I got some imported fruit. So I got a brown uh, Korean pear, and then I got another Asian pear. They both looked very tasty, so I got one of each. This was like, 89 cents and this was like three dollars so glad i only bought one the last thing i got is my guilty pleasure these seaweed snacks they're my guilty pleasure because they're full of plastic and they use palm oil which i don't feel super great about oh god camera is having a struggle well just trust me that it's vegan the ingredients are like wheat flour seaweed palm oil tapioca starch sugar spices so i hope you enjoyed today's rendition of floor groceries if you liked it give it a thumbs up subscribe for more because every month i'm going to be posting a grocery haul because that's what i like to do i've been severely burnt out but you know we're figuring life out and trying to get by so i hope you are all doing well doing okay and not as burnt out as i am <laughs> all right Thanks for watching, bye.